they're unveiling the sculpture right now, the Bill Barrett sculpture. Uh, that's a, being an, a new addition to the museum here. And Mr. Barrett is here. So, taking it down right now. There we go. Yay! A little bit of rain out here. Uh -oh. This is Bill Barrett's sculpture. It's called 911 from the Lexeme series. It was made in 2006. We have the artist here. <laughs> Mr. Barrett, do you mind if I get a couple of words from you on video? Would that be okay? What do you want to do? What's that? What do you want to do? Well, I just want to talk. Just want to ask a couple of questions about the sculpture itself. And you have the maquette right here of what uh, of the larger piece that's outside that we just, that we just took pictures of. Uh, is there? Um, uh, and now it is called 9-11 and it's from the Lexeme series, so you have a number of these? I did a whole series of 9-11 sculptures uh -huh. and it's based on these geometric shapes are the symbols of what the World Trade Center buildings were. They were very mm -hmm. geometric, uh -huh. slabs sticking up in the air. But when when the 9-11 the occurred, there were a lot of, there was a lot of, um, <laughs> A lot of bodies that were involved in, you know, thousands of people who were in the building. Who had thousands. suffered and died, yeah. And, yeah. and yeah. some got out, some didn't. But um, it's, this is just a symbol of, of the energy of what was going on at the time. Mm -hmm. and that's all. And it, it was all subconscious on my part. Mm -hmm. I did not do this thinking of the World Trade Center. Right. I was doing it for uh, aesthetic reasons, for my own purposes. Right. But, uh, but it is, so it is I still, did make yeah. a symbol, and then I said, you know, I can see that what I was doing, because I started making these right after 9/11 occurred. Right. My studio is uh, 11 blocks from the World Trade Center, yeah. and so that's why I, it affected everybody, of course. And this is what I did because of that 9/11. I just, I understand. Very beautiful piece. I like it. I like it a lot. I mean, I'm a, I'm a very much of a fan of formalist art. So I mean, <laughs> so I say it, 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 it is that it's. Uh, I mean, there's a certain. There, once you look at it and you see that there is sort of a tower and a sort of you know the yeah. the symbolism of the uh, of the fire and the loss of life. Right. You you right. can you can see, you can see that. But that's, um, that's what you can get out of that mm -hmm. is You you as a, as a viewer can interpret what's going on. Right. And, and put your own self into that work of art uh -huh. so that you feel a part of, of the piece. Uh -huh. and therefore, you can sort of, uh, I think you can enjoy it more. And you, can, you can get into it as a viewer and, and enjoy what you're looking at as well as uh -huh. knowing that the artist was that the artist doing, yeah. doing his thing. Uh -huh. well, I thank you. I thank sure. you so very much for taking the time to talk to me. I appreciate that. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>